Hello everyone, welcome to another challenge video. This time we're going to answer the Train Freaks switching challenge. For the English viewers that's a shunting challenge. So uh, it's been a few weeks since this challenge um, was put out. Um, I've been busy with a number of other things. But anyway, I thought this would be a good opportunity to show you the operations around my uh, industrial area. So, let's take a look at that. So here's a look at the industrial area. You can see as I pan around, there's some pretty complicated uh, switching patterns in here. Main lines are in the background there. And there's my main control panel. And it includes the lumber reload yard there. And where the switcher sits there now, that's the limit of its operations within the um, industrial area. It cannot go beyond that point or it ends up in the yard or out on the main lines. Uh, that's going to be important to us as we complete the switching anyway. Now I don't know how well you can see this. Um, but anyway, I just wanted to show you, this is what we do on the Highland Valley. We have a switch list uh, for train orders, all handwritten on a fairly standard form. Our train today is the industrial switcher, our loco is 1366, and we have a number of operations there, mostly pickups. This is the pickup column. One set out, so we're going to pick up and set out one of the cars. So, at the bottom there are a few special instructions and we'll deal with those as we get going here. So here we can see the switcher tied up and the crew discussing the day's uh, switch list. Now in a normal operating session here on the Highland Valley Railway the list is much longer than this and it can take up to an hour to uh, to complete this switching. We're going to try and shave a few minutes off of that today. Anyway, the crew looks over the uh, the switch list. They've got a pickup of a tanker car at Weird Works. They've got an RBL, which is a box car with uh, tie down straps built-in tie-down straps or, or movable bulkheads uh, within it. That's to be picked up and set out. Picked up at Murray Agricultural and set out at Weird Works. They've got two grain hoppers to pick up at Agro Feeds. Uh, a gondola at Specialty Steel. Those are all empties. And there is one load to be picked up at the reload yard. So they are now working out their order of business here today. Let's get underway.
Now in the special instructions it says that this tank car is to be set out by the Weird Works tanks. They have storage tanks. So I'm going to push that all the way down into the tanks. Now our other uh, special instruction was to set this coil car within the crane gantry at specialty steel.
There we go. Five pickups, well, six pickups and one set out. And the final instruction was to tie up the train at the yard limits. Right there. There we go, Jason. I hope you enjoyed that. Bye for now, everyone.